So what's on the program, Anthony? So this program is a juxtaposition of modern music and ancient music. We use different instruments to help with this juxtaposition. It makes it very, very obvious. We have some modern pieces, modern pieces like some Stravinsky, we have some Schnitka, we have some Ravel, we have some ancient pieces, we have some Pergolesi, we have some Coupin, Coupin. some François Coupin. Yes. How do you like playing the old music, the older repertoire. Oh, I love doing that, actually. Uh, it was really funny because not long ago I asked a baroque cellist to give some advice and he said, play with your heart. And I was like, thank you so much for making it easy <laughs> and easier. <laughs> <laughs> respect for this kind of music and we do think that you know if we don't do this above this way then we might not be you know allowed to play that and I'm right. I'm, I'm not trying to be a baroque cellist properly I think I'm no. just trying to play baroque music the way I like it uh, and the way it feels natural somehow. and we have Spiegel and Spiegel in the middle yes to kind of bring to the light that we have new pieces about old pieces yes and old pieces who thought they were new I guess yeah <laughs> I do have a modern slash old um, cello. Yes. Because it was made as a viola da gamba, so it was made in 1620. So actually, it's older than the music we were playing right mm. now. Mm. And um, it was then later made to a modern cello. So that has gone through the mirror as well, through so the transition. So it, it, it makes it interesting. I, I feel when I'm playing ancient music on that cello that I'm using the old side of the cello. And yeah. then I, I use the modern side and we play Schnitke and Stravinsky. It is also interesting when you have this, I mean, these modern pieces that we're playing, the Schnitke and the Stravinsky, have a very backward looking, baroque looking slash neoclassical bent to them. So when you're kind of, you're doing slightly harpsichordy things on the modern piano, and that's also just an interesting kind of inflection slash reflection point. Yeah, do you want some more flat white? <laughs> I would, no. Something to eat. I'm getting a bit. Yeah, peckish. let's let's let's, let's get peckish. something to eat. Yep. Yeah. 